We are libertarians, and we believe that sex work is work. It's as simple as that. When we say that, that means that it, it's just a kind of work, just like any other kind of work. And in a lot of places in the United States, actually, most places in the United States, this kind of work is illegal. Well, it depends on what kind of sex work you're doing. Because sex work is a really big, broad umbrella term. Sex work can pretty much just mean that anything that is a type of work that gives somebody those weird, sexy feelings. For some reason, we've decided that when it comes to exchanging money for things that give you sexy feelings, mm, maybe we should outlaw that and throw people in cages instead. We as libertarians challenge that idea. We don't think that you should throw people in cages for making voluntary exchanges. We believe that there's lots of different forms of selling our skills and selling our bodies that we're okay with. If someone sells the ability to hit them and to cause them pain, like an MMA fighter or a boxer or pretty much any sport, that we're perfectly fine with. You can pay them lots of money. In fact, sometimes you can pay them endless amounts of money to do that. If someone wants to sell their skills and their body in order to give someone pleasure, well, that gives us sexy feelings, and so that might have to be outlawed. And it, it really varies depending on what state you're in. So what counts as a sex act and what would be considered illegal, that you're going to have to look at your local laws. In one state, uh, Nevada, there are different counties where it is actually legal, but of course it has to be licensed work, so you just have to follow the laws of your local government. The reason that we believe that sex work is important to advocate for decriminalizing is because it's just one more example of causing more problems by throwing people in cages for voluntary exchange. When we say that sex work is work, it means that it should be treated just like any other work. And sometimes people will argue for, well, that means licensing. Sometimes people will say that should just mean decriminalizing it treating it like anything else that you can go into by just choosing to learn a skill, take up a trade. One of the main reasons that people will say that you shouldn't decriminalize sex work is because sex work involves human trafficking and that it is an inherently dangerous industry that leads to people being exploited and it is not something that we should ever allow and that is why it makes it so much better to put people in cages when they want to engage in this market. If we learn anything from the drug war, from prohibition, from any black market in history, the violence and the human exploitation that comes with it, that's more inherent to the black market than it is to the product itself. And when you create a black market, you reduce and eliminate the incentive for people to seek out legal, voluntary means that don't hurt anyone because you're forcing them to break the law anyways. When you force somebody to break one law in order to do something that's peaceful, it makes it a lot easier for them to justify breaking another law and maybe not questioning whether or not they're making another peaceful decision. We as libertarians believe in decriminalizing all peaceful activity because when people are given the freedom and given the opportunity, people choose to act peacefully with each other just because it's in your best interest. Because the kid who doesn't play nice doesn't get anybody who wants to play with them. So treat sex workers just like any other kind of workers. That it's a job. Sometimes it's a hard job. Sometimes it's a fun job. But it's a job that some people choose whether or not you agree with it.